To make a PICX 28X1 or 2 programming circuit, you're going to need some jumper wire, 4.7K resistor, 10K resistor, 22K resistor, the PICX chip itself, breadboard, and the programming serial cable. I show how to make this in another video. A power source uh, between 4.5 and 5 volts. I'm using a 4.5 battery pack. Okay, now to build the circuit. We're first going to install the PICX chip. We'll install it in about there. Just make sure that the uh, dot or notch is towards the edge of the board here. I'm also going to uh, I'm going to make this the positive rail and this one the negative rail. Press it in firmly but don't bend any of the pins. Connect pin 20 to the positive rail. 20 would be, see this is 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. This pin, positive. Pin 19 to the negative. Pin 8 to negative. Let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And the 4.7K resistor to pin 1. And then place it way over to the side. And then where you plug it in there, do another jumper to bring it up to the positive rail. And the 22K resistor. Install it on pin six. Two, three, four, five, six. And bring it over here. And the 10K resistor, connect it to the end of the 22K. Put it and then connect that to ground, like so. Now connect the programming, serial programming cables, wires, to connect the red to the junction between the 22 and the 10K, the yellow to pin seven, one, two, three, seven, and the white to the ground. And last, connect a jumper to uh, pin one of the pickaxe and just leave it floating. We'll be using that as the reset switch. Okay, now to program. You're going to need to plug in the serial cable to the computer I'm going through a USB to serial converter. If you happen to have the a serial port in the back of your computer, I'd recommend using that instead. If not, then just use a USB. Now to set up the uh, PicX programmer, uh, PicX programming editor to program, 
you have to make sure that you have it uh, set up for the 28 X2 that's the one I'm using right now this circuit would also work for the 28 X1 if you wanted to yeah I'm gonna make a little test program just so we can download something all right now we're gonna need to uh, apply some power to the circuit attach the battery to it battery pack I'm doing a positive to positive ground to ground fairly straightforward now just before we download plug in the uh, reset cable into ground as soon as we start downloading it from the editor you're going to want to hurry it back to it and pull it out now we're all set click program ready the program run over here unplug the cable and it's ready the pro it's programming there we were successful well thank you very much for watching this video I hope you will see all my other videos on my channel Fox Know How